So we're here in Coniston at Yew Tree Farm, which is a National Trust property. And that's a very good thing because you can really trust them to look after old things. That's probably why they're called the National Trust now I come to think of it. Perhaps they'd look after me because I'm very old. Yew Tree Farm was built ages ago in 1693. In the 1930s, it was bought by one of the most interesting women who's ever lived. She was very clever. So I was lucky enough to come here and visit last year. And while I was here, I met this very interesting person. So interesting, in fact, so curiously fascinating. I actually wrote him into my new Peter Rabbit book. Now, I suppose I should give you a couple of clues about this very special person. He's very handsome, very sort of regal, and if I'm honest, he is a little bit full of himself, but I, I like that. And he's, he's a turkey. Hello. <laughs> Hello, William. It's so exciting to see you. I've really been looking forward to this. Hmm? No, we did. We did ring. We, we rang your agent. We arranged this. We, it's been arranged for weeks. You look fine. You look absolutely fine. Look at me. I'm just wearing my old dungarees. You look magnificent. I've got some great news, William. I hope you'll be as excited as I am, because I... Well, the fact is... I've written you into my new Peter Rabbit book. Yeah, aren't you excited about that? William, you're about to become the most famous turkey on the face of the planet. Let me tell you the story. Mr and Mrs McGregor um, have invited you, as it were, to their Christmas dinner. You're going to be their guest, if you see what I mean. <laughs> no, no, you don't have to RSVP. No, I'm, 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 not on the, I'm not on the guest list. I'm not in it. I'm not in the book. I've written it. I'm not in the book. I'm not coming to the... It's just a story, William. It's just a story. It's not actually happening. It's got talking rabbits in it as well. Well, it, I, I think it could work, actually. What? Children like turkeys more than they like rabbits. Anyway, so it's also going to feature your very good friends, Peter Rabbit and Benjamin Bunny. And they are going to save you. No, 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 not shave. Save you, William, save you, not shave. Where would they get a razor from? Why would rabbits want to shave a turkey? I think this could take longer than I thought. No wonder Beatrix steered clear of turkeys. the same scarf as me. I thought mine was the only one. I thought this was unique. Why has he got one as well? Where did you get yours? Turkey and an actress. Both wearing the same scarf. That's a first. <laughs>